Today, Tikva, it's Rabbi Fine, you know me, but we have a big announcement on May 4th, our second annual celebrity fundraiser with Inbar Lavi, the great act, Israeli actress. We're so excited to welcome her to Deerfield, Illinois. Inbar, how are you today? <laughs> I'm good, Rabbi. I'm wonderful. Thank you so much. All right. And she's not, just in case you thought she's in Israel right now, she is not, but she's not in the country. We won't tell you where she is. We're just going to sort of like give uh, the congregation just like a little bit of insight into you and, and your career a little bit, but we're going to do the whole big interview on the BIMA in, in a few weeks or a few months. Um, so question one, so an Israeli actress, when did you start dreaming about being in Hollywood? <sighs> wow. Um, I, I, I will say I, I do have early, early memories of, of me kind of, you know, Im imagining myself and envisioning myself in, in a different place. Um, I love Israel um, so much. It's such a huge part of who I am and it will forever run in my veins and it's my home. Um, but there, there was a feeling as a child of, you know, this like, this desire and yearning to see what's outside the walls. You know, I, I grew up in Hulon, right outside Tel Aviv. So it was like a small town kind of a feel. And I always was really curious to see what was out, you know, what else was out there to see and experience. And, um, and I remember watching, you know, big Hollywood pictures that had you know, so much production value and and just everything looked so fantastical um, that we didn't really get to see in Israeli cinema just because of the budget. <laughs> and um, and I was always really drawn to that, you know, just I I wanted to fly far and wide and um, and I, I it started early on for sure. So we, we were talking about this a little bit that there's uh, an influx of Israeli actors uh, coming to America. Uh, yourself, obviously the most famous, probably Gal Gadot. Um, she, uh, she's also, I think, the tallest. Uh, Oded Fear and, <laughs> and and Shira Haas, right? So like when I grew up, there weren't a lot of Israeli actors or actors. I probably can't name one, but now some on, on major screens. I mean, Shira Haas is going to be a, a, in, a, in a Marvel Cinematic Universe and Oded has had such a great career and Gal Gadot's er, body of work speaks for herself. Why is it that we're seeing Israelis sort of pop up on the mainstream uh, movies. Any insight to that? Yeah, I mean, it's a combination of things. You know, it's it's a, I think the audience is a bit um, tired of, you know, the same stories, the same, the same kind of type people. They are, you know, the world is a variety and a plethora of, of human beings. And um, and those, the stories are more unique and, you know, colorful. And there's there are so many different cultures. And I think um, audiences have just grown tired of seeing the same Jack and, you know, Lucy stories, they want to see a variety of people. And um, so that's, that's, that's one. Um, and I think Hollywood has been listening and uh, paying attention to that need. And it's a wonderful thing. And also, you know, streamers, um, everything's different. We're not, it's not just we go to the movies, we actually can pop something on and uh, very easily be connected to everywhere in the world. And so, you know, that that basically changes everything and everyone from different places can watch any kind of content. So you can have different languages and you can have different people and you can have all these different ethnicities that um, back in the day wouldn't have had the chance to be be a part of it cool love it so let's just uh you're you're gonna be the next season of found out correct mm -hmm. and anything what that mean, we what do you mean the next season of found out this season of found out this season this yeah, season it's happening already it's, and uh <laughs> 
how excited are you to be a part, part of such a influential show that people everywhere are watching? Very, very excited. Um, you know, it's my first project in Israel. I, I've never worked there before. And, um, you know, my family is obsessed with the show. And so when I got the call um, asking if I would be interested, I was very, very interested, obviously. And I feel like it's um, it's such an important show. It really um, shines light on a lot of subjects that are you know, are really, really, really important. And um, it was um, it was a privilege and an honor. I love it. Thank you so much for spending time. May 4th at B'nai Tikva uh, in Deerfield, Illinois. Inbar is going to be joining us. We're going to have a, a wonderful night of conversation and, and smiles. And uh, we're excited to see you in person. I can't wait. Thank you so much. See you soon. Thank you.